Hello to all the good people at Crash Champions 0550. It's David at Discount Forklift. I am proud to be standing here next to your brand new 6,000 pound lithium ion powered forklift made by Lift Hero. If you'll notice here, we've got your company logo right on top of your company colors on this. I think this forklift came out beautiful, fantastic. I love this forklift. Um, her name is Marlee. I'll tell you a little secret. Marlee is a workhorse. She'll do you a great job, but if you call her by name, she'll do even better. Um, just call her by Marley and she'll give you that extra little bit. And who doesn't love an employee that gives a little extra? In this uh, little goodie bag here, I want to show you, I'm going to send you a t-shirt. Here's the evolution of lifting. Backside of this is the uh, um, Lift Hero bit there. Also, I have a hat in here. That's our favorite brand of forklift. There's the Lift Hero. I've got the forklift maintenance guide. Now, this being a lithium ion forklift takes away a lot of the maintenance on a forklift. Even being a sealed battery, you don't even have to water the battery. But nonetheless, I'm gonna send you this uh, forklift maintenance guide. There's lots of little tips and tidbits in there. Lots of good information in there. Back behind this little tab here, there is um, all these checkoffs forms. Uh, I always recommend that people um, leave those in the book here. That way you always know where to go to have a clean original when you need to shoot more photocopies of that. Um, right next to Marley's name tag here, there is the little door here. That's your charging port. If you notice, there's a warning sticker right there. Very, very important, guys. When you go to charge the forklift, make sure you turn off the forklift. Take the keys out of the ignition before you do that. Just pop the little door here and uh, you've got a rubber cover on the uh, charging port right there. That will mate up with the charger cord. Uh, charger will be on the back of the forklift in a cardboard box. It's powered by 110. You can plug that in anywhere. So no reason you can't do that. Don't let your battery get down below 30%. That's one of the uh, unique things about lithium ion forklifts. If you get close to that, plug it in, give it a little charge, you're good to go. Want to go through the forklift controls with you here. We've got your typical three levers. We've got your up, down, we've got your side shift, and we've got your, I'm sorry, up, down, tilt, and side shift. Testing myself there. Also on the dash here, you'll notice we've got two levers on the uh, steering column there. Left one is the transmission, three positions. Up is forward, uh, middle is neutral, down is reverse, and this side has your lights and your blinkers on it. Also on the dash, you've got a uh, parking brake right here. Very important. We'll come up with that and talk about that in just a minute. Next to that, that red button there is your battery cutoff. That is not something you're going to ordinarily use. You're only going to use that if you've got to maintain the battery or something. But if uh, you go to do your startup and it does not work, your forklift will not start up, check that. Make sure nobody's pushed that down. If they did, just pop it back up. You should be good to go. Over here, I want you to notice these tires. Love these tires on the forklift. This is not grandpa's forklift tire. These are great tires. Whether you're inside or outside, dirt and gravel, uh, pavement, whatever, if you've got moisture, you're good to go with these tires. Should do you quite well. Um, you'll notice that this has lithium ion, uh, I'm sorry, LED lights on it, on both the uh, turn signals and the lights. Up on the mast here, We've got a service sticker, just been serviced. That's a good way to keep track of your service intervals. On the front of the forklift, we are very, very safety conscious at Discount Forklift, just like you guys are. We want everybody to go home safe and sound at the end of the day. These forks being painted like this will help you see the forklift uh, where the forks are. If you're in a dark spot of the warehouse or outside when it's uh, not quite light in the morning or, or dusk, whatever it might be. As far as safety goes, important that you know there are four important things you need to know before you start the forklift. First, I just did. I put my butt in the seat. You've got an operator presence system in the forklift. If you are not sitting in the seat, it will not start. You cannot move the forks up and down. You cannot do anything. So you got to be sitting in the seat. Number two is common sense, but I just fastened the seat belt. Same thing with that. If you do not have your seat belt fastened, it will not operate. Number three is you get to have the transmission in neutral. Number four, you've got to have the parking brake on. All real simple. The forklift is not like grandpa's forklift. You won't hear the starter on it. There's no engine in it. It's lithium ion battery powered. So when you turn it on, it needs about 15 seconds to go through its electric checks. 
and you're good to go on that, but you won't hear the grind. Just turn the key on, leave it alone, and it will do that. Um, there is an audible alarm on every time you turn the key on. You'll hear that. Probably not on the video, but you will in person. This um, alarm is on all the time. It's an awareness thing. We want everybody around you to know that the forklift is there and operating, and that way you can uh, um, get everybody to go home safe and sound at the end of every day. I'm going to start this forklift up. First thing I'm going to do is a brake check. Good brakes. Happy with that. You notice there's a grab bar back here. If you're backing up, sometimes it's convenient to grab onto that bar. There's a button on there. That red button is the horn. Also on the in the middle of the uh, steering wheel here. So whichever way you're good to go with that. Let me put her through her paces here real quick. Show you what she can do. Forklift is a very peppy forklift. I think you'll like it. This space is actually too small to show you what she'll, she's capable of. But I'm confident that once you get her, you'll be very pleased with her. Okay, guys, here's your headlights. Good LED lights on there. Here's your signals. Let's go ahead and run the forks up. Bring it back down. And then tilt it all the way forward and all the way back. Here's your side shift. That'll really come in handy when you're moving things. Um, guys, we appreciate you uh, supporting our business so we can support businesses like yours. I'm anxious to get uh, her to come home to you. You can put her to work. Thanks again for your support. And here's your serial number. Thanks, guys.